Hi, this is Tanya Atomic, and this is my review for Slumber Party Massacre 2. Um, Slumber Party Massacre 2 is a bizarre film. Um, it's an 80s film, and I feel like it could only have been made in the 80s. It's really interesting. Um, it's a group of girls, and they're in this girl band, and they play music, and the music's in the film, and it's this, I don't know, it's great. It's like really funny, weird music. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's not like totally weird, but it's like funny. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It's like music made for a movie. So it's kind of like bland in a funny way, but sort of interesting. I don't know. Um, and then there's this, um, guy, one of them dreams about this guy. She's having sort of psychic dreams about this killer who is like this rock and roll um, 80s rocker, but kind of like 50s greaser with like this guitar that drills people and kills them. And he sings too, and his songs are even like funnier and weirder. And, um, you know, they're all like going away to have this, this sleepover. And, and the movie is like going, it has a certain tone for a really long time. And, and then, which is like kind of fun. It's like fun and weird and funny and sort of a little bit campy. And then all of a sudden things change because the killer comes out of the dream and is real and starts killing people. And then it's it's still campy and fun and weird and funny, <clears throat> but it's like all of a sudden like run for your life time um, for the rest of the movie. Um, I don't know what to say. I mean, I can't say it's high art at all, but um, it is super entertaining. This movie is very entertaining. Um, it's a little bit weird and it's a little bit campy, although it's played very straight. Um, and it's like, you know, mid to low budget. It's not super low budget or anything, but it's like not high budget. Um, it's a fun, it's a fun movie. I enjoyed it. <laughs> I enjoyed this film, even though it's like, you know, bizarre. Well, I mean... Not even though. I mean, it's pretty obvious I'm going to like something like that's bizarre and campy and has weird music in it. Um, so, <laughs> yeah, it's one that I enjoyed. I would recommend it to people that like camp, people that like 80s films. Um, definitely. Like, if you like 80s films, if you like, it's not high camp, um, but if you like a little bit of camp and, um, you know, like kind of fun stuff where there's like music and a weird killer. I don't know. It's an entertaining one. Um, so from here we follow one of the girls, Heidi Kozak, we follow her to the movie Society.